all right so welcome gemini's i'm back y'all with another video this is going to be for the sun moon rising venus um south node and north node okay so if you are new to the channel welcome come on in come on in go ahead and click the subscribe button would love to have you here all right let's see what messages we have for the gemini what message is there for Gemini, please? For the remainder of February. We're getting ready to do March readings. Yes, we're going into Pisces season. All right, let's see. Messages for Gemini, please. For the remainder of February. Messages for Geminis, please. All right, let's stop here. Oh, we got the Five of Cups here. All right, so the Five of Cups is showing regrets, okay? Big time regrets. Maybe you feel like you could have kept your money. You could have saved. Um, I could have saved. You feeling like you could have saved your money on the situation. Um, if you would have knew that uh, you was going to have to cut somebody off. Yeah, I'm getting a relationship or some type of tie here. Okay, but I'm getting that there's some issues that definitely need to be worked out. All right, let's see. We got the Three of Pentacles here. The Knight of Wands. We also have the Queen of Cups. The Hangman. Nine of Swords. Page of Wands. Three of Swords. See, yeah, y'all are hurt about something. Okay, something... Um, there could have been a breakup, the Knight of Cups, Ace of Cups, and the King of Pentacles. You could be dealing with the Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I see uh, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries here as well. Pisces here. It could be any sign. Okay. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? I'm getting like somebody was playing both sides. Why is the Three of Pentacles here? The Ace of Pentacles. Okay, so. All right, so I'm getting, this could be a work situation. This could be dealing with the fire sign. Oh, look at this. Yeah, somebody has some secrets here. Somebody got some secrets. Somebody's slinging something somewhere else. Okay, this is the secret. Somebody's playing some type of mind game. Somebody's possibly even doing some magic tricks here somebody pulling some a rabbit out of their hat about their ass why is the ace of pentacles here why is the why is the ace of pentacles here seven of wands all right so you happen to stand up and defend yourself here maybe there was a a I'm getting like maybe you bragged on this person or this situation. I'm getting for some, this is work related. Like this is someone that was a, some temporary thing that was going on possibly at work. Um, why is the Queen of Cups here? There could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio involved. Six of Pentacles. You gave this person your emotions. You gave this person your heart. You gave this person all of that. But now I feel like you've lost hope in this in this connection. You lost hope. And some of y'all have walked away already. Y'all already walked away for something new. Um, you're ready to break free out of, of this, you know, this person's wing. Yeah, the Empress. This could be a third party too as well. Because we got the devil here. Queen of Swords. You guys, this energy. I'm getting that there's some type of truth came out here. Possibly about a third party. Why is the Knight of Wands here? Oh, yep. Somebody, somebody got some options here. The Knight of Wands and the Seven of Cups. Somebody got some options here. Somebody playing some games. Yep. Why is the Hangman? Whew. Five of Swords. I feel like. There's some jealousy going on. Possibly a fire sign could be involved. 
But I'm getting there's a lot of pettiness. Like you, I, but I feel like you're waiting on it. You're waiting for the pettiness. You're waiting for it. It's like, come on. I'm waiting on it. I'm waiting on it. Come on. Break it. Because at the end of the day, you may feel like this person, uh, I'm getting picking up. This is you guys' energy with the lover cards here. Hierophant could be a Taurus involved as well, too. But I am getting that there's some type of love triangle. Okay. And somebody is a liar. Somebody is too sneaky. We got the Seven of Swords. Could be a Leo. Picking up Leo, Aries, Energy, Sagittarius. Um, but definitely somebody here. This person could be like real handsome or real, really charming here with this King of Wands. But they're sneaky, okay? This person could even be a little older than you. I'm getting Leo or uh, Aries Sag. Yeah, this truth. Maybe you're waiting for other people to come forward with their truth. You don't feel like you have to put in no effort. You know, you're not putting in the effort to go reach out to them. You, I feel like you're waiting for them to come to you. Or this is something that you've been waiting. You, oh, look at this. The Seven of Swords wants to jump out again. King of Wands and the Queen of Wands. So there's definitely, I'm picking up like third party. I feel like this had you up. This had you up. You know, you were thinking about it. Yeah. Yeah, you were overthinking. You're overthinking over here. Yeah, you're trying to come up with a plan. Okay, I do feel like uh, communication is getting ready to come in. So this person is going to want to reconcile with you. Judgment and the Three of Cups. I'm definitely getting second chance, third chance. Somebody wants to reconcile. Okay. I'm not sure if you want it. Because I got the Ten of Swords and the Nine of Cups. Um, I'm not sure if you want it. I feel like you're losing hope. Um, but I still feel like you... I still feel like you hang on to this person a little bit, but at the same time, you're kind of ready to walk out. Some of you have already walked out, like I said, and some of y'all are like, you know what? I kind of might, I, I kind of want to break free of this, this connection. I want my freedom. I want to do some new things. Okay. I want to do some new things. I want to see what's out there because I feel like this person really broke your heart. Yeah. Yeah. And maybe you ready to get, get a little karma. Okay, you got to find your balance again. This person knocked you off your balance a little bit. You know, this was a little surprise. They knocked you off your rocker just a tad bit. And you know, you might be feeling like, you know what? I'm about to do me. Yeah, see, you know that there's a lot to, um, to balance out, to work out. There's a lot that needs to be worked out here. Yeah, see, some of y'all want, want something new. Now, this person is coming to you. They are getting ready to communicate with you. Got the Knight of Cups and the Fool. Yeah. They're getting ready. They're going to reach out to you first. But they don't want to make it seem like they're spying on you, but they are. They're spying on you. And they don't want people to think that you're single either. Because you, I feel like you're really a good catch, especially with the Nine of Pentacles and the Queen of Pentacles. Like, you a good catch, um, and they don't want to lose you over some sex here. We got the Devil and the Ace of Wands. Like, to them, they're looking at a situation like it was just sex. But you're looking at it like, nah, you're not going to play me like that? Mm-mm. Yeah, see, they're they're reaching out. They're telling you that they're sorry. They miss you. Okay, I'm definitely picking up and picking up. Like, they're going to be reaching out to you, telling you that they miss you. In your hopes and fears, we got the Ace of Cups and Ten of Swords. I don't, I don't think that you're going to be as open to this person. I don't think you're going to be as open to this person. Here we go. You guys energy with the lovers. Why is the king of pentacles here? 
the Ten of Swords. Like I said, I don't know if you're going to take this person back. I feel like you want them to put in a whole... They're going to have to do a whole lot. They're going to have to put in a whole lot of effort. They're going to have to show you better than they can tell you because I feel like you're tired of... You're just tired of looking, you know, silly. You're tired of looking crazy. I don't know if you're going to... I don't know. I feel like some of y'all are ending this situation. Yeah, for some of you, there's a divorce um, with the Ten of Swords and the Four of Wands. Yeah, this is all falling apart. And you're walking away. You've been patient long enough. Okay, your intuition was telling you already that it's time for you to move on. You still have feelings for this person, though, with the Four of Pentacles and the King of Cups. There's feelings still there, but the situation, there's, plenty, there's too many things that need to be balanced out here. Yeah, for some, I'm getting it. There's a marriage here. King of Cups, somebody's husband. Okay, but I'm getting like, there's still feelings here. But I'm getting like, mm, for some, there's a divorce um, on the way. For some, there's a breakup, like, and not really, you know, taking it serious to get back together. Like, this person's going to have to show you. Show you something way better <laughs> than what they're showing you because I don't see y'all going forward right off the bat. Mm -mm. All right, so if this message was helpful, guys, go ahead and leave me the thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, share, subscribe if you're new. If you're interested in booking a personal, that information is in the drop box below. As well, guys, check out my website. I have body butters. I also have intention oils that are handmade by me. I have spiritual pieces, all that stuff. A lot of goodies over there on the website. Go ahead over there and check all of that out, guys. And thank you all for your support and your love. All right, until next time, ciao for now.